Welcome, friends, to our next Bhagavad Gita lesson. Let's prepare ourselves with our slow, deep breath. Hari Om Tat Sat. Om Shanti. We reached a landmark episode number 100 entitled Nowhere to Run. And we're on the 51st verse of the second chapter. I'll read it to you. The wise whose balance is firmly established, having lost interest in the rewards for their actions and freed from the bondage of rebirth, undoubtedly attained a state beyond all sorrow. This is one of the verses that I say to myself every day. Sri Krishna says that the sign of the wise person is that they're established, firmly established in a balanced state of mind. For the rest of us, through our attempts to remain balanced as best we can, we gradually grow wiser. As karmas present themselves in the forms of our challenges, our ups and downs and our disappointments, we tend to be caught off guard, despite the fact that they occur regularly, if not daily in our life. As we mature on the path, we begin to not sweat the small stuff so much, and we're less overpowered by reactivity, anger, fear. And as we grow wise enough, we see that it's all the small stuff. And then Krishna says that we undoubtedly attain the state beyond all sorrow. We can't run from the karmas that we're destined to face, and we shouldn't want to. It's better to stand our ground and to recognize that the situation in front of us is the only way we're going to ever get firmly established in balance. One of Swami Sasananda's early teachers, Sri Swami Chidbhavanandaji Maharaj, put it this way. I'll read it to you. It is characteristic of karma to perpetuate the wheel of birth and death. But the yogi in his wisdom handles the bondage producing karma in such a way that it becomes a freedom yielding one. For the homework assignment, next time something comes up that makes you cringe or groan, say, Hari Om, welcome, or some version of that. I was speaking to our interim executive director at the IYI a few days ago, Hamsa, and she what she does when things aren't going the way she was hoping, she says, oh, now that's interesting. Find your own way. See you soon. Om Shanti, Shanti, Shanti.